welcome back to my channel. This is Lex Me with another video. Today, I'm gonna show you how I take down my makeup. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah, so basically, I'm just gonna show you what I do at night when I wear like a very intense makeup look. And I first, first start with removing as much makeup as I can with my Garnier cleansing water. So you're gonna see what that looks like. And I only use about two cotton pads to remove it and I just remove as much makeup as I can so my washcloth doesn't stain as much as it would if I didn't uh, wipe it off. So I'm just gonna wipe under my eyes and just anywhere where I have makeup. I just wanted to show you guys how much makeup does come off when I wipe my face. Look at that. Isn't that crazy? Um, I still have some under my eyes, but I know that my cleanser will remove that excess. So I'm not really too worried about it, but I'm just gonna go in with another uh, cotton pad and just go around my face. Next, I'm gonna use my Cetaphil, the daily facial cleanser. And I normally use about two to three pumps of this, uh, nothing too crazy. And I will cleanse my face with my hands. So I just make sure that I go around in like circular motions and try to get as close to my eye as possible. But I usually target my forehead and my cheek area because that's where I have excess makeup. So after rinsing my face, I do go in with a washcloth and just pat dry my face. I still have excess makeup around my eyes and my forehead um, just because I guess it just didn't come off, but I will end up wiping it off just so my face is as makeup free as possible. All right, so for my second cleanser, it really just depends on the day for me. Um, I felt like I had a ton of makeup and clogged pores, so I just went in with my Be Your Charcoal Cleanser. Um, when I just have a regular day, I just go in with my Foaming Cleanser by Aveeno. But yes, I'm just gonna cleanse again using my new Vanity Planet Spin Brush and, you know, get this face nice and pretty and shiny. I've really been slacking, but I apologize for how my nails look right now. I literally just got them done. Y'all about to see in my next video. So if you're interested in seeing how my nails look, I got a stiletto style, you know what I'm saying? But just, I apologize in advance cause I'm looking at my footage and it looks wild. going to exfoliate with my Neutrogena Pore Refining Exfoliating Cleanser. I love this cleanser, um, especially because I need to minimize my pores. My pores are ginormous and this just helps uh, just kind of make them smaller and helps with oily skin as well. I pause real quick because do y'all see the glow? Do y'all see the glow? Because if you knew how my face was before, you would see the glow. Mm-hmm. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Period. So I just wanted to show you my washcloth because there's barely any makeup on it. Um, this is how you want to have your washcloth all the time. You do not want to have your washcloth looking brown like how I used to have it. And this just helps, you know... Oh, what am I doing? Hey, 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 get it, hey, let's get it. What, what? I'm sorry. But yeah, it just helps, you know, the life of your washcloth and just keeping your face clean. Oh, here I go. Lord have mercy. Oof, that lace. So now I'm just gonna go on with my Witch Hazel Toner, the Pore Perfecting Toner by Dickinson. And I'm just gonna wipe this all over my face, you know, after I exfoliated, cleansed, all that good stuff. 
and just to have a you know more shine you know this just helps with the shine again with pore minimizing and oil control All right, so last but not least, I'm just gonna moisturize my skin with the Cetaphil Moisturizing Cream. This is intended for dry and sensitive skin, but I'm using it anyway. Oh, hey, hey, yo, I really got some dance moves, like, <laughs> hey, let's get it. Oh, it, oh, Cetaphil, shoot, I could really be promoting Cetaphil. But anyway, yeah, I just use that. <laughs> I just use that to moisturize my skin. Um, I do not use a lot at all, and I just put it all over my face and make sure it's all in there. And that's the last step. This is how I do my nighttime. This is how I do my nighttime um, routine in terms of my skincare. Specifically, I used an exfoliator because I had a ton of makeup. Well, I felt like I had a ton of makeup on, and I just want to like do a deeper clean. So um, when I try to do a deeper clean, I usually use the Bior. A charcoal cleanser and an exfoliator but if I'm just doing like a light clean like I probably didn't wear makeup that day I would do the Aveeno facial cleanser but really just the pants but this is how my skin looks you know I have or used to have acne so do not come for the dark marks we're working on it we're working on it um, I hope that you guys enjoy watching this video and that you enjoy being on this journey with me I will have bomb skin Okay, 2020 is a year I will have bomb skin and a nice body and wider teeth and longer hair and, you know, better relationship with God and all that good stuff. So we're just going to put positive, you know, droplets into 2020, you feel me? But yeah, make sure that you like and subscribe to my channel. If you want more content like this, make sure that you leave it in the comment section down below. And I hope to see you guys soon.